So this Tampa Pride VIP party is just teaming with all kinds of fabulous, important, powerful people in Tampa. And standing next to me here is Bob Buckhorn, the mayor of Tampa. Welcome, Bob. It's good to be here. I don't know if I fit any of those qualifications, but I'm here with you. Oh, we, we really think you do. I have a friend of mine I uh, was talking to last week who's a Republican, and um, he said he had run into you at some conference or event or something and um, had made the comment to you that even though he hadn't voted for you or was not aligned with your political thinking in general, that he was very impressed by the way that you pursue your political goals and what you do uh, in city government. So, Well, that, that's great to hear. My mother would tell you I have way more courage than brains. Um, <laughs> but yeah, through all the ups and downs of my career, the victories, the defeats, I, I never lost sight of the fact that I wanted to be the mayor. I knew the mayor could have the biggest impact of any job in politics on this city. Right. And so I just kept working until I got there. And you've been instrumental in having um, the rainbow flags flying uh -huh. here. You were involved last year with the response to the Pulse Absolutely, Massacre. Yeah. And, uh, you know, this year we're doing, at Pride, we're doing a tribute to Pulse as well. Yeah. I and um, so there'll be a little taste of that as well. But, you know, you've always been there for us, and we really appreciate that. We're glad to see that you're here. Um, at the at the Pride VIP party. Well, I wouldn't miss it, and the city's a proud sponsor of this parade. Uh, we, you know, we were one of the first ones to step up and say, "Let's do it." It's gotten bigger and bigger, and I think what it says about this community in particular is that we're a place that honors that diversity, that celebrates it, that uh, shares in everyone's successes, regardless right. of the God you worship or who you love. That's who we are, and we're proud of it. And a lot of people remember, um, you know the the anti-gay legislation that was around here for about 10 years. But really, no, a lot of people outside the city don't realize that was a county-imposed yeah. regulation, and the city has always been in favor of um, you know, a diverse community. Absolutely. I remember when I was working for Sandy Friedman, when we passed in 1992 the first human rights ordinance. Tampa's had this in place for 30 years, 30-plus years. Uh, yeah, the county struggled for a while. Thankfully, Commissioner Kevin Beckner got there and was able to get his colleagues to, to go along with the city. Yeah, but for a long time, the city was the only uh, bright light in Hillsborough County. So I know we don't have to ask this question, but I'm going to ask anyway. Are you going to be at the parade on Saturday? I will be at the parade. I've been at every parade, haven't missed one. Um, I will be there throwing beads and reveling in, uh, in another amazing Tampa day. So you heard it here first. The city of Tampa mayor's office will be closed on Saturday so that the mayor can attend Tampa Pride. <laughs> well, I work every day, so it's, uh, right. no, we're going to be there. We're going to have a great time. It will be a wonderful parade. Well, we look forward to seeing you there. And you we're got glad it. to see you here again. Absolutely. Thanks for taking a moment to talk with us. You got it. Thanks. Thank you.